Hey everyone, we're going to do a quick unboxing. I know it's been a while since I did an, uh, a video. So this morning, I um, get a notification from Amazon on my phone for one of the items that was on my wish list. And that was the uh, Theater Box uh, 3D surround sound Bluetooth speaker from this company right here. A Smile or a Simile, however you want to call it. So I... It was on sale. I guess they were once I clicked onto the link, it was like uh two hours for until the sale end or something like that, or one hour and forty five minutes. So it was uh when this speaker first came out on Quick Starter, it was like three hundred dollars. And then um it went down to like two fifty or two forty nine and then it was down even more to like almost a hundred and fifty for uh for the for the next uh two hours or one hour and 45 minutes when i was looking at it on amazon's website so i jumped the gun and ordered it i ordered it this morning before i went to work went to work got back to work and it came in today or just when i got home it was already here waiting for me the box so we're just going to do a quick unboxing <laughs> Um, I'm feeling kind of under the weather, so this will be a really pretty quick unboxing. And this is shot on my LG V10 in full uh, Quad HD or 4K. So let's unbox this right now and take a good look at it. And then a review coming in the next few days. So here it is right here, theater box wireless virtual 3d speaker that's taking it out of my out of the amazon packaging down there and here's theater box so this is the front of the box and uh we're just gonna do a quick walk through around the box the top of the box just says is theater box wireless 3d speaker and i guess that's the model number i got the black version and then uh you got your, I guess, serial numbers or barcode over here. And then the back of the box, it shows you all the different colors. You got black, red, blue, and white. And uh, some specs right there with uh, 3D, Bluetooth, Aptex and uh, NFC and then the bottom there's nothing and the side of the box right here is uh, sh I guess it compares a traditional speaker where you have to be facing the speakers have to face directly in front of you and uh, the theater box it doesn't matter um, how you place the speaker the sound should be good on all three or four directions so let's unbox it even more okay so this is another box within a box so this box was inside this box you have this little like a uh, ribbon to pull the to pull it out of the to pull it out of this box right here and then inside this box is all your stuff so first you get this uh, it's protected by these uh, on each side by these like foam and then here's the speaker itself it feels pretty heavy uh, pretty much the same it feels the same or maybe even a little bit more heavier than my um, other Bluetooth speaker the Klipsch which we'll compare it to in a little bit you get the power adapter inside this box and you get the power cord you get a 3.5 adapter wire adapter so if you want to plug it into um, whatever you want to plug it into that doesn't not have Bluetooth and then you get your instruction manual so that's it for that one
Okay, so having removed this speaker out of the wrapping, out of the box, let's take a look at it. Let's put this clip aside first. So up top here is where all your controls are. Let me um, try to focus on there. You got NFC here, so you can pair it NFC. It seems like they're um, what they call capacitive uh, buttons. You got plus and minus for volume probably you can control the track uh, backward or forward it might be this way I'm not sure and then you got you can take phone calls and you can mute it so this speaker has like you can get sound from all four directions it's got drivers here in the front you got your a smile or assembly logo over here and then you got another driver here on the side some more drivers here in the back and also on the back of the speaker you have your plug for your 3.5 millimeter jack that's for the power cord that's to pair Bluetooth and that's for power right there. I'm not even going to power it on right now. We'll, we'll power it on. Well, let me power it on right now. Let's power it. Let's see if there's any power on here. Let's see. It doesn't seem like they're... Okay. Did you guys hear that? So there's a little bit of power on there, and it's blinking right now. Okay. So this feels, man, the box felt significantly heavy. It, it probably felt like it was about six, maybe more pounds. So this is it compared to my other favorite Bluetooth speaker, my Klipsch. Um, KMC1. They look like, let's see, it's a little bit longer and a little bit taller than the Klipsch. You can probably put the Klipsch on top of this and we'll find out. No, they seem about the same length, never mind. So it seems like it's the same length as the uh, clips. Height-wise, the clips tallest end is almost as tall. The because the clips kind of slopes down, the clips tallest end is almost as tall as the ace mile and that light is blinking because this probably wants me to pair it up but this is the end of the uh, unboxing so that's it um, this once again this was this is the ace mile theater box 3d virtual surround speaker and uh, full review coming soon it was on sale for like 159 for the blue one 179 for the uh, for this black one off of the normal 250 or 249 dollars and it was only for a limited time so I guess now the sale is probably over so normal price for it 249 on Amazon Prime with free two-day shipping so that is it that's the unboxing stay tuned for the full review coming soon everyone take care have happy holidays and I'll see you again next time